Hello, and welcome to Viral Watchlist. We bring you the best of wealth creation from the ever-growing crypto world. Today, we have the simplest, yet one of the most entertaining games until now. It's a heavily rewarding, zero-sum price prediction game. Eager for the in-depth review? Then stay tuned till the end of the video and don't forget to subscribe. So without beating around the bush, let's hunt down the target. There's a new NFT game in town, The Crypto Prophecies. It is a DeFi powered player versus player price prediction game where players go head to head with others for zero sum wagers. Players take the role of crypto prophets who act out the price prediction battle based on their unique magic properties. The TCP token powers the ecosystem and acts as a utility and governance token. The Crypto Prophecies uses cute and unique NFT characters known as Crypto Prophets and items that come from four different magic schools. The magic ability of each NFT is based on the rarity tier of the NFT, which also determines the number of daily rewards an NFT can earn. The game centers around price prediction, a simple concept but also incorporates a play to earn feature through a PVE experience to earn the magic potion tokens that are used to summon and burn NFTs. Well, let's talk about gameplay and playing conditions. Before entering the fabled battle arena, one must choose which of their profits they want to send into battle and how many TCP tokens they want to wager on their success. Once a player has chosen which profit they will send into battle and what associated wager they will place, the matching engine searches for a suitably skilled player with the same wager desire. The battle will commence once an opponent is found or challenged and accepted. The arena rules are simple. Each battle consists of a set number of trading candlesticks, which also defines the time frame of the battle. For example, if the battle was played on 10 second candles and there were 10 candles in total, the game would last for 100 seconds. The core gameplay involves trading candlestick pattern recognition. Players must predict the outcome of each trading candlestick. Will it close up green or down in red? Also, the price feed is live and accurate that directly comes from Binance. The battle arena uses a point system, which includes the factor of time to make it more challenging. Each candle starts with a maximum of 100 points available. As the candle's time reduces, the available points for that candle reduce concurrently. If a player gets the prediction wrong, they lose the equivalent number of points based on the time they made their prediction. The arena battle modes will expand to allow players to form alliances and create group battles such as 2 vs 2, 3 vs 3, and 4 vs 4. All the game modes are points based and every point scored, gained or lost, in every battle is stored on chain and goes towards the player's leaderboard score. The leaderboard will be segmented to show the highest scoring players on a weekly and monthly basis. Each segment of the leaderboard has its own prize structure for the given time period, with prizes given in either TCP tokens or other cryptocurrencies and NFTs. The prize amounts will be funded from the ecosystem allocation and will vary over time. If a player owns an NFT crypto profit that has slots to contain magic items such as staffs and wands, then the player can equip new NFT items into those slots that have spell casting capabilities. Spells can be cast during battle to hinder the opponent's chances by reducing their visibility of the trading candlesticks or removing their ability to predict entirely for a set amount of time. There are many different spells available, each with different effects. The winner of the battle is the player who scores the most points. This is not always the player who predicts the most candles correctly. The winner of the battle arena takes all minus the 3% kingdom fee. The daily prize pool is generated from 40% of the kingdom fee so that it becomes a community pool and grows in size based on the number of games played and the number of wagers placed on any given day. All daily players will be entered into a daily prize draw where each game played gives that player tickets for the daily prize draw. If the player wins the battle, tickets are issued based on the profit used tier multiplier and the wager placed. If the player loses the battle, tickets are issued on a one-to-one -one ratio with the size of the wager. The more games a player plays and the higher the wagers placed, 
the more chances a player has at winning in the daily prize draw. There is a social hub where players can socialize and talk prophecies while waiting for their next battle. There is also a battle arena feed feature where all matches and results are shown on a real-time activity feed. This will show the player names, the time of the match, the market stakes, and final scores. The activity feed also encourages additional gameplay and observation. Players can challenge other players that they see on the activity feed. The Kingdom Chat is also a great feature. It is a real-time chat app to engage in conversation with other players on the platform. You can create chat groups with multiple players or message individuals. There is a real-time feed for all players that are online either active in battle or passive. Online players can be interacted with, challenged to a battle, added as a friend, or sent a message. NFT trading is already happening on OpenSea for crypto profits and their items. Their NFTs are utility-based as they are used in-game as playable characters or magic items. NFTs allow access to many game features, including the ability to double your tokens in 60 seconds. You can equip magic items that have a range of casting abilities during battle. You can also burn the NFTs to gain higher rarity tier NFTs. The Crypto Prophecies OpenSea listing are now live, and the first 48 hours saw exclusive founders rare NFT minted one-of-a-kind Crypto Profits or Magic items, of which there will only ever be a maximum of one minted per generation. Founders NFTs have already been listed for 2 to 4 Ethereum. You can see the NFTs are massively priced. The costliest is Stardust, which is listed for a price of around $400,000. Other NFTs like Tally Whip and Hydras also cost over $200,000. So don't waste time. Start buying or minting the rarest crypto prophecy NFTs. This project is made in partnership with Animoca Brands, Polygon, Chainlink, OpenSea, and Moonwell. They also have the backing of big investors like Spark Capital, Lotus Capital, Morningstar Ventures, GBV, Altvest, Kronos, and other investors. Therefore, follow all social media handles of the Crypto Prophecy so you won't miss any of their announcements. Crypto Profits. With five rarity tiers and over 40 unique Crypto Profits to find in Generation 1, there is no telling which one you'll summon. Will it be Blaze, who can easily crush paper-handed opponents with his overwhelming attacks? Or Ember, the young Satoshian who suffers from the occasional bout of FUD? Could you get lucky and find an honorable Ethereum ancient wizard such as Hollow Prince? Or Shroom, the most creative of the four elder Ethereans who sees visions of the future? Maybe you'll be blessed with a friendly Tasmanian arcane mage like Callisto. Or be able to huddle with Ferox, the Tasmanian who uses his powered arcane magic to maintain peace within his region. Will you be able to harness the mind-controlling powers of the evil reptilian Sludge? Or the cunning and savage Fudster Oozer, who punishes opponents by trapping them in terrifying illusions? With so many Crypto Prophets to collect, who will you summon first? Crypto Prophecies. Play more, collect more, earn more. As always, all the links are given in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press that bell icon. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.